what's up guys uh, welcome to this video today I'm gonna be showing you how to uh, download and install Windows 10 without any kind of errors whatsoever now if you are upgrading from Windows 7 to Windows 10 and you have your services and your service that's called Windows Updater disabled this will cause a massive problem during the installation of Windows 10 and the reason for this is Windows uh, has to, Windows 10 has to download updates for that particular operating system so if you're using Windows 7 and you're updating to Windows 8 or Windows 10 it needs to update it needs to find the updates for Windows 8 8.1 or 10 in uh to uh ensure that it has the correct drivers installed for that particular operating system so some of the errors that we might see might look like this might look like this and this and if you guys have um your microsoft updated disabled and you try to do a manual installation you still might get stuck at the installation process if you do it manually which is like from from an iso or your thumb drive or uh, a disc it still might get stuck at at a particular part now to fix this it is relatively simple all you have to do is download these two applications which is the media creation tool which is the tool to download windows 10 and install it and the second one is the diagnostic tool which is going to fix the issue with with what you have uh for your uh installation process or any kind of issues such as this 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 and this so once you have um, downloaded both these applications you want to open up the diagnostic tool first to ensure that you don't have any kind of errors going into the installation process so you open up the application you click next and uh, what it's going to do is it's going to search for any kind of corrupted files in your cache clean your cache out and essentially put it in a healthy in a healthy state so you can actually download updates now if you guys are uh, already started the installation process already and you're stuck that is fine all you have to do is open up this application and um run click next and it will search and resolve all the problems that you have during the installation process if you move on to the next step during the installation process and you get stuck again all you have to do is uh open up this application once again click next and it will resolve it it will resolve all the problems that you have during that installation or during that step rather now once you get to the last step it's going to tell you the uh choose what you want to keep on your computer if you want to keep your personal files if you want to just do a, a full install which is just going to delete everything on your computer uh, which i would do not recommend um that's fine it's just all, it's all up to you so once you get to the last step it's going to ask you to uh which which files do you want to keep and just select personal which the one that's selected and uh it's going to start installing windows and it's probably going to restart and you're going to get to a screen that looks something like um something like this but it's not going to get stuck but this is a screen that most people get stuck on because they have 
uh, Microsoft Update, uh, Windows Update rather, disabled. But it's going to take about an hour and a half and uh, it should fix your issues with the Windows 10 installation. Now again, if you guys have any kind of errors during your download, uh, getting your updates while this is installing, just run this application while it installed while it's while you get that uh that while you're having that problem and it will fix that particular problem during the installation. That's all you have to do. It's really simple. So uh thank you guys for watching this video. Um I hope you guys uh resolved your problems with uh this particular issue. If, if you find this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, um, subscribe to my channel, and uh, peace.